Would you be in favor of creating inmate work details to be utilized by both the county and the cities? And um, would you be in favor of using the West Georgia boot camp facilities for a new county jail? Mr. Kimball? Thank you for the question. Again, uh, uh, the boot camp is a, is a relatively new facility. Uh, it could be used for a county jail. I've been in it and, and looked at it. I know it's set up as a dormitory type system, but I think it could be uh, with funds and here again using inmate labor to do the labor that needs to be done there. To change it around to, to meet our needs. And, and I, I understand that we do need a better facility than what we currently have. And it's in such a great location. Uh, yes, I agree with inmate laborers here again as opportunity when I worked for Carroll County during the summertime through the school year I was a resource officer and a dare teacher. During the summertime I had the occasion to work inmates. Uh, those inmates told me they would rather work than sit in the jail. To me that's a plus because when you're working you feel better about yourself. You have a different outlook on what's going on in your life. So if we got them out there and gave them an opportunity to work, we're not going to force anyone to work, but give them an opportunity to work, there's a lot of things we can do for Harrison County. We can uh, work on the sides of the road, and one thing I, I recall is one summer when there wasn't any kids in the schools, we worked at Bill Ricca High School, and we built a weight room. So I think there's a lot of things we could use inmate labor for, accomplish it a lot, and also helping our inmate to have a better outlook on it themselves and hopefully not having so many repeat offenders. So that's my opinion. Thank you very much. That is another good question and I appreciate you asking it because I'd like to explain my views. Yes, I would like to see inmate crews working in Harrelson County. Four years ago, that was one of my promises to the people of Harrelson County. I quickly learned that a jail being a pre-trial facility, that you can't work legally work inmates until they've been convicted. One of the problems that we have in Harrelson County is the jail population. It makes it very difficult for judges to sentence to county time and so forth. I'm trying to speed up, I see my time running. The boot camp would be perfect. They've got to do some renovations. They've got to be some funds spent to bring it up to state standards or pre-trial facility. I've already spoken with the judge that if we get the boot camp, would the possibility be there to keep a wing for the judges to sentence the county time? And doing that, that would allow me to start a work crew like I'd like to do it with inside the county. That would give us room to do that. Uh, kind of lost train of thought. I seen the paper over there. But I've written a letter to the Department of Corrections trying to explain to them why Harrison County needs this boot camp. That we don't have the money, that we're looking to save money, we're looking to save taxpayers' money, and anything that they could help us with would be greatly appreciated. I have tried to work in making inmates in our local facilities such as uh, the youth program, not the youth program, but the gym itself and Buck County and so forth, but I better shut up. Thank you.